स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव ऑफ एक्सरसाइज इलेवन पॉइंट थ्री नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव सीज फ्रॉम अ सर्कुलर शीट ऑफ रेडियस फोर सेंटीमीटर अ सर्कल ऑफ रेडियस थ्री सेंटीमीटर इज रिमूव सपोज दिस इज द सर्कुलर शीट ऑफ रेडियस फोर सेंटीमीटर ओके फ्रॉम दिस सर्कुलर शीट ऑफ रेडियस फोर सेंटीमीटर a circle of radius 3 cm is removed suppose this is the circle of radius 3 cm okay this is the this is 3 cm okay. now if the circular sheet of radius 4 cm if the circular sheet of radius 4 cm a circle of radius 3 cm is removed means if you remove this circle from the bigger circle then how much area is left we will have to find the area of the remaining sheet so if you remove the smaller circle from the bigger circle this area will be left right and how to find this area this is the remaining area so how to find the remaining area if you subtract the if you subtract the area of the larger circle suppose this is the area of larger circle if you subtract the area of the smaller circle this suppose this is the radius of the larger circle and this is the radius of the smaller circle so if you find the difference of these two you will be getting the area of the remaining sheet right so let's start so at first we will find the area of the larger circle so area of the larger circle area of the larger circle is say pi r square this r is the radius of the larger circle okay and area of the smaller circle is pi r square so this r represent the radius of the smaller circle so to get the area of the remaining we need to subtract this to subtract the area of the smaller circle from the area of the larger circle so it is pi r square minus pi r square here this r remember this capital r denote the radius of the larger circle and this small r denote the radius of the smaller circle now if we take out pi then what will be left it's r square then we have minus and if you remove pi from here then r square will be left okay now pi will remain same and r square here r is here r is the radius of the larger circle which is 4 cm so it will be 4 square and this r denotes the radius of the smaller circle which is 3 cm it will be 3 square since it is r square that's why we have written 4 square and since it is uh, r square again that's why here it's written 3 square now now pi multiplied by 4 square is 4 into 4 16 and 3 square is 3 into 3 9 okay now the value of pi is given which is 3.14 So three point one four will be multiplied by sixteen minus nine is seven. Okay. Now, here three point one four multiplied by seven. It's seven fours are twenty eight. Eight two carry seven ones are seven. Seven plus two nine. Then three sevens are twenty one. Now we will have to put the point here. Point is after two digits. So one two. Here will be the point. so it will be 21.98 square centimeter okay so the area of the remaining sheet will be 21.98 square
square centimeter. So this was question number five. Now moving on to the question number six. Now question number six says, Saima wants to put a lace on the edge of a circular table cover of diameter one point five meter. This is the circular table, and Saima wants to put lace around it. Lace on the edge of a circular table cover of diameter. 1.5 meter so this is 1.5 meter we will have to find the length of the lace required we will have to find the length of lace required means total length around the circular table because lace has been put on the edge of a circular table so to get the total length of lace required we need to find the circumference of a circular table isn't it now to find the length to find the total length of the lace required we have to find the circumference of a circular table because we have to find the total length of the boundary right so this is the total length of the lace required now we will have to find its cost if cost of 1 meter is rupees 15 cost of 1 meter lace is rupees 15 what will be the cost of this meter less so to find the total cost we need to multiply the length to the rate per meter Right, so let's start. Now, given diameter is one point five meter, so what will be the radius? Radius is half of diameter. Radius is t by two. Diameter divided by two. Now, diameter is one point five divided by two. So one point five by two meter is the radius. Now instead of dividing one point five by two, let the value remain like this. Okay. Now we know that length of the lace, length of the lace required, will be equal to the total length of the boundary, which is two. Pi r. Now, two will remain same. Now, according to the question, pi is three point one four. So we'll put the value of pi as three point one four, and radius is one point five by two. Now, two and two will be cancelled. So if you multiply three point one four by one point five, you'll be getting the total length of the lace required. Let us write the unit, which is in meter. Now, three point one four multiplied by one point five. So five four. At first, you ignore the point. So five four is a twenty. Zero two carry. Five one is a five. Five plus two seven. Three five is a fifteen. Now we'll multiply by one. Four one is a four. One one is a one. Three one is a three. So zero seven plus four is eleven. One carry. Five plus one is six. Six plus one is seven. Three plus one four. Now we'll count the number of places after the point. So one, two, three. So one, two, three. Point will be here. Okay. So it's four point seven one zero, or we can write four point seven one meter. Okay. So this is the total length of the lace required. Now we will have to find the cost of the lace. So total cost. Will be length multiplied by rate. Here rate is given rupees fifteen per meter means one meter. Uh, here cost of one meter is given rupees fifteen. So fifteen should be multiplied by four point seven one to get the total cost because if cost of one meter is rupees fifteen. Then what will be the cost of four point seven one meter? It will be multiplication. So length multiplied by 
rate which is 15 ok now 4.71 multiplied by 15 so 15 ones are 15 5 1 carry 15 sevens are 105 105 plus 1 is 106 so 10 is there so 15 fours are 60 60 plus 10 is 70 ok then we have put the point which is after 2 place so it will be rupees 70.65 ok so this is the total uh, cost of the list required ok so this was all about question number 6 thank you students